Wade and Wade reacts. This is our reaction to Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater, the first in game look. So let's see what they have for us. That's clean. I can't wait to play this. For me either. What? You see how the mud is moving? Took him out as quiet as possible. Yeah, this looks real good. Clean, clean graphics. And look at the detail. That's crazy. Wow. I remember back in the day, you could only get that level of graphics with the cinematic trailers. Yeah. Then it would switch to the game and it would be something totally different. And you would ask, why can't they make the games look just like the cinematic trailers? But now we're getting that. Yeah, one thing I'm seeing from this, which is could be asking too much, I thought this was a remake. This looks like polished graphics. Like they, they did remake it, but they did like how they did with um, Dead Space when mm -hmm. they remastered that. I thought, this was a, I thought this was a remake instead of a remaster because I would like to play Snake Eater instead of level based, like a completely open world game. Yeah. Where I can transition from one level to the next. The whole map is there. Yeah, like Ghost of Tsushima. Yeah. That would be best. I noticed that too. I was looking at some of the mechanics. I'm like, this is, he's moving just like he did in the original Metal Gear Solid 3. Yeah, I was looking at the map too because how they had some of the hills slanted up. We know with current gen, if they would have did a remake, he could just climb up that hill yeah. and go, you know. But I guess they, you know, people still gonna buy this game. I'm gonna get it because I'm gonna play it. Oh yeah. Hopefully, I mean, hopefully it is a remake, but like you said, it doesn't look like it. But still, this is a game I'm gonna play. The graphics are, are crazy. Yeah. The textures, the detail are top notch. Yeah, it's what the, you thought games looked like yeah. back in the old days. <laughs> <laughs> and this is really the beginning of the exploration of new gen technology. So I yeah. can't wait to see what graphics and gameplay are gonna be in the next two, th two to three years. Yeah, hopefully, since they did the graphics update for this, they do the same thing for the first Metal Gear and the second one, because I would like to play those updated graphics. Yeah. I know this game wasn't as popular, and I've never played it. I still want to get it on Xbox 360, but it's the Metal Gear game with Raiden. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know you're talking he's, about. I think he's a full cyborg on that one. Yeah, I would like a sequel to that. Yeah. But I don't think that game sold that good, but... If they spend the same amount of time as far as the story that they spend with the, with the, um, what do you call it? The, cause that's a spinoff, but the main Metal Gear games, I would like them to put that same seriousness into the writing game, but have that same off the wall slasher type combat. Yeah, that right there, that would have the fans spending all their money to get that game. <laughs> all right, y'all, that does it for our reaction to Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater first in-engine look. Don't forget to leave your thoughts down in the comment section. Are you gonna play this game? Let us know. Also, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you'll never miss a video from Wade and Wade Reacts. And we got it. Peace.